What if we told you there's a secret world right in front of your eyes? The microscopic world of bacteria. It's in the water, in the ground, and even right on us, on our hands. But unfortunately, not everyone will get the chance to see it. Because not everyone will have access to a conventional microscope. But what if you're a kid without access to technology? They will never get to see the microscopic world because it's inaccessible for them. If you can't see it, how can you understand it? This is the world we are in today. Science isn't available for everyone. But does it have to be this way? Not anymore. I want to introduce you to the creators of a microscope that fits in your pocket. Jim and Manu invented a paper microscope, the Foldscope. This microscope can be assembled in just a few minutes. And it works just like a regular microscope. It allows anyone to see objects up to a thousand times bigger. This guy is still alive. You see his heart beating there? Right here? It's maybe a little scary. Now, anyone can see what bacteria looks like. You can even attach it to your phone's camera to see the magnified world of tiny bacteria on your screen. That is insane. That is absolutely stunning. 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 Foldscope is the window to a secret world that now anyone can see anywhere. Your grandfather, your mother, and your sister can use this microscope. Those who hike and love nature can use this microscope to see what's on the trees. Health workers can use it in remote areas to save lives. And especially the children around the world can directly engage in science. Do you see that? Where am I? Instead of just folding paper airplanes, you can now fold an entire microscope. You can make your own discoveries and gain practical knowledge, no matter where you are. Because of Foldscope, you can see the world in a new light. So I woke up today and I checked my phone and I saw this picture of a village in Tamil Nadu, India of kids opening up these pouches and exploring their microscopic world around them and this happens every single day. Finally, science is accessible not just to university students but to billions of curious children. Let's make science and scientific literacy a human right because if we educate our children they will have the power to build a better world of the future.